Hey guys, it's Anna, Assistant Manager here at Barbell Brigade. Um, here with another update video on my bikini prep. Um, so, just like you guys, I've been in quarantine. I believe, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I still don't really know what day it is. Um, it keeps fluctuating. Uh, but I believe it's been a little bit more than a month. As far as all my gym workouts, I had the pleasure still been communicating and keeping up with um, my coach, Stanley Merklin. Um, I sent him all of my equipment that I had at home, which was a couple resistant bands, um, a couple kettlebells, thank God, um, and a hip circle. And I sent it to him and I was like, is this possible to work with, you know? And Thankfully it was, um, I guess it's a good thing of having such a good coach. Um, he was able to switch everything from my program back to a, a home workout program. Um, did he make things easier? No, humble workout, uh, humble workouts. Workouts at home do humble you. As far as a diet, I actually did take a break from it. Um, the, the first couple weeks were just a little bit way too stressful for me and um, my coach felt like since I had kind of just started the prep, he felt like uh, I didn't need to add a stress on um, also keeping up with my macros. Although I know some people like that's good, you know, to um, like the added stress kind of helps them be more stricter with their goals. But unfortunately, I don't work like that, and um, I needed a little break. You know, if there's anything to like cut off from the edge. Um, I think that was it. Um, that doesn't mean that I kind of just went like loose with it and like enjoyed all my snacks. No, um, I mean, granted, I wanted to. And there was times that like I did like indulge, but um, for the most part, I still kept it uh, relatively intuitive. You know, um, I made sure I was still having enough protein each day because that's something I lack with. Um, as far as protein, I tend to if I don't track it or really take into consideration how much protein I'm taking at each day, I will only eat. 30 40 grams of protein which is not ideal especially for bikini so um that's the only thing i try to really um, focus on but with the last couple of remaining weeks i'm going to go ahead and go back to strictly macro tracking um i started yesterday which is monday um the you see i have no idea what day it is whatever day was yesterday i started that day um but I have a couple weeks left that in the quarantine, um, I hope so. And um, so I'm going to just go ahead and be super strict with everything. Um, I'm excited to go back into the gym, not from square one, but at least close to where I started because I know um, just naturally my body's gonna be super fatigued coming, returning to the gym. Um, real gym, not my back gym over here. Uh, so I want to at least come in a good mental space and health space. So at least, you know, excited, excited, excited. You know, did he make the, the workouts easier? Hell no. Um, I feel like body weight workouts and home workouts really always humble you down. Um, no matter what weight you are, it's going to be challenging because you are going relative to your body weight, you know? So, yes, I'm in for a ride. Even though I'm here, um, I've still been gaining a lot of mass and, um, you know, making them gains. Uh, am I gonna make the same results as I would have if I was still at Barbell Brigade? Probably not, you know, but I still don't want to lose the, the gains that I have made, you know? So even though I have uh, quite a space in my backyard to do lunges and squats and things like that, for certain things like um, banded uh, kettlebell swings, that's where, you know, I have to get creative with what I got. Um, it's like a greenhouse back here, but there's this pole here um, to hang laundry. And it seems to be the only pole that I have to be able to sustain like a band around it. Um, so I'll show you guys my little invention here. It's my bird right there. Um, so right below we have the pole. I went ahead and tied uh, my band on there. 
And now I'm gonna do kettlebell swings in this little area here. That was it of my workout. Um, hopefully you guys liked it. If you guys wanna continue um, seeing my journey to the bikini competition. Oh, look, here's the gym staff. I'm sure it'll be way more easier as soon as like we return back to the gym. Stay strong, we're all gonna get through it together. Um, if you don't have um, a coach or any a program or anything like that, be sure to be checking out our lockdown workouts. Um, I believe we're posting um, a new workout every day and it should be also on the website. If you go ahead and go to barbellbrigade.com, it uh, should be there. Um, so no excuses, right? Uh, we have our I believe those are all body weight, no um, equipment necessary. So go ahead and check that out. Um, as far as a diet, we can do it. Let's push through. Or at least I'm telling myself that, right? Motivation all comes from within. So hopefully that goes well um, as planned. Um, go, I'm gonna go ahead and take uh, the remainder of the time um, to stop being so stressed out. Um, taking it day by day and um just focusing on my goals um there's certain things right now that we don't have the power um or control over you know um as far as life and things like that things that are happening right now but something that we do have in our control is um staying on top of our goals at least to the best of our ability um i know like like i said um our our progress isn't gonna be like the best or the quickest as it would have been if we were sent in a gym. Um, but you also don't wanna be in the negatives, you know? So hopefully we're all keeping uh, our spirits up. Go ahead and take care of um, the, those vulnerable near you. Um, continue washing your hands, be safe. Hopefully all you and your loved ones are all being taken care of. Um, and see you guys soon.